Here comes the field for tonight's ninth race, $9,000 open one pace, exact to try, effect the one, Noble Sam. Noble Sam is owned by Vincent Rakestraw, Greg Rodosky, and Vincent Miller with David Miller. The two-horse Call Me Nuke has been scratched three Hoosier Wiz over the White Creek Stable, driven by Jeff Fout. Four Rosemont Scholar, owned by Andrew Phyllis with Rodney Connor aboard. Here's the 5KL Sharpshooter, owned by Tony Weir. Mike Wilder will be on the bike. Six Kick in the Pans, owned by Ron Carbone and Harness Stable Growth, and M. Masidi with Ron Carbone. Seven, Matt Can Do. Owned by Sam Noble Jr., Jim Daly will be in the sulky. Field for the ninth, scratch the two, call me nukes. Post time in six. And months. there they go. They're off in pacing. Matt Can Do on the far outside gets the first call. KL Sharpshooters leaving tonight. Along the rail of favorite is in the third. Noble Sam, they're down the back stretch. Hoosier Wiz is fourth. Rosemont Scholar is fifth. Kicking the pans will have to come from the back of the pack. On their way to the quarter, Matt Can Do from the Sharpshooter horse. Two more lengths into the favorite, Noble Sam. Here comes Hoosier Wiz, the fourth. Rosemont Scholar, fifth. Kicking the pans is sixth. They open up 27 and two. Speeding past the stands to the half mile pole. Matt Can Do, where he likes it best, is on the front end. Matt Can Do skims a pylons a length and a half. KL Sharpshooter, the stalker, in second. Two more lengths to the favorite, Noble Sam, in third. Second division, fourth back to Hoosier Wiz. After that, the Rosemont Scholar, the trailer, and try to adding fuel to the fire, kicking the pans. They're at the half mile, Paul. Matt Can Do and Jim Daly are there in 56. Realistic clip here in the co feature. They're out of the turn and down the backstretch. Matt Can Do can do so far. Matt Can Do leads the way. KL Sharpshooter closer second. Here comes Noble Sam driving up on the outside third. Tipping and rolling live cover. Hoosier Wiz the fourth. Rosemont Scholar skims the pylons fifth. At the end, it's kicking the pans, and now the real racing begins right here. Leaders are heads apart, rocking by three quarters. 124 and three, they're getting serious now. Three lengths would cover this field at the eighth pole. From between horses, Noble Sam sticks his nose, his head, his neck in front, but he's not home free yet. Here's Hoosier Wiz attacking wide on the far outside. Two lengths now covers this field of six. In between horses, Noble Sam. Hoosier Wiz, here's Rosemont Scholar up on the far outside, under the whip, Hoosier Wiz is going to get it. Here comes winner of tonight's ninth race, three Hoosier Wiz. Classy seven-year-old son of Abercrombie out of way to be. Over the White Creek Stable of Palm Beach, Florida. Trained by Ron Potter, given a well-judged drive by Jeff Fout. Covering them out here in 153 and 4. Number 3, Hoosier Wiz, the winner. And that is a four-bagger tonight. That's the Mario Lemieux, the hat trick, plus one for driver Jeff Fout. Windows are now up and on tonight's 10th race. Post time, 15 minutes away at 10.40. Dan Ader driving to Sand Rook. To Sand Rook being driven by Dan Ader. Post time in 15 minutes at 10.40. Exact the $17.60 on the trifecta, $61.80. Late. Hoosier Wiz, the winner. Rosemont Scholar, third. KL Sharpshooter, fifth. Kick in the pans, fourth. Matt Can Do was sixth. 